one of the things that drew me to science is that it is one of the most potent systems and mechanisms that humans have ever devised to seek truth and to get to objective truth. This is why scientists are always, and scholars of all stripes, are always targeted by authoritarian regimes because we speak truth. That's right. Indianapolis, Carmel, Greenwood area all together. Did you know that we are ranked fourth in the entire U.S. for the number of employees in pharmaceuticals? That's over 16,000 people. That's a critical driver for our entire state, but not just Indiana. The science that's happening here in the Hoosier State matters for the entire United States and the entire world. So we have to stand up for science because it's not just for us. It's for our friends and neighbors across this country and it's for our friends and neighbors around the entire world. Science matters here, but it matters here because we impact every single corner of this globe. When science and facts are under attack, what do we do? Stand up When science and facts are under attack, what do we do? Stand up by facts. the lab, into the street. It was important to me to bring my daughter because the world that we are leaving is the one she'll inherit. And you know, her ability to be healthy, to have a positive influence on her community, um, and, and to have the future that I, that I dream of for her uh, depends on continued scientific research and progress.